inside the train, it's really quiet. Feels like I came to Inaka. Do you see the Ferris wheel over there? Yes, that's the place where we are heading to right now. Now we are in Tamako Station to the Save and Theme Park. We have to ride that train. <laughs> it's a small train. Technically, you can walk too, but uh, riding on this train easier. So let's ride on. Why don't we go to check the front? From here, it feels like the theme park has started. And we already arrived to the Seibuen UNG station. Yeah. <laughs> Just a minute. And here we go. The entrance must be around here. Let me see. So today we are at Saitama Prefecture, Save and Yuench, which is one of the popular theme park in Japan. As you see, it's a super classic amusement park, but uh, after they renew it, there is a retro food street they made it, so I always wanted to visit here. Today, I got uh, this ticket. 3,600 Japanese yen, you have the credit inside the park. The ticket price is 7,800 for adult. It's a bit pricey, hope it works it. <laughs> By the way, if you don't have a ticket, you can get the ticket over there. But today, we have a web ticket, so let's go. So since I got the web ticket, I can just place the QR code over here. And it's working, sweet. By the way, that's the most popular ride over here, the Gozira the ride. Seems like today it's not that crowded, so less waiting time. I'm happy. So I need to get the money for the inside the amusement park. Let me see. I have to go to the post office, the green place. Oh wow, nice. So it's a retro food street. I'm so happy it's not crowded. Seems like I can film it much easier. But first, let's find the post office. Oh, must be this is a place. So uh, let's get the money here. Hi, Sasekaitamas. Sweet. So we got money here. So this is the money inside the park. Uh, 100 Sebian Park yen is about. 10 US dollars. So 120, 30 Japanese yen, I'm not sure the exact price. And uh, you can buy the foods and the stuff with this. Well, one thing you have to be careful is that uh, there is an expiration date, which is today. So if you are visiting here, make sure you use the money in the day. Otherwise, it will be wasted. Well, but uh, it could be souvenir too though. Anyway, so let's explore the park. Oh, by the way, hey guys, welcome back to Ryan's TV. I'm Ryan Seno. Go. Oh, by the way, still in Japan, yes, mask culture exists. Well, so don't forget to wear the mask. Anyway, so let's explore the retro town. Let's go. <laughs> I was wearing the mask totally weirdly. Anyway, so <laughs> let's go. In the entrance, there is a police station. And uh, you can see inside too. Oh, that's the black phone. It's the old phone in Japan. I'm not sure in the world standard. I've never seen the real one yet. Uh, I think they use it in 60s maybe? So this is the main snack store in the arcade. They have a fushigi dagashi. Maybe I should save money for this and uh, try to find out what it is because I'm not sure what it is. Anyway, so let's check inside the store. Oh, they have all the toys inside. Have you guys seen this? This is a kendama. You can actually buy it with 40 yen. So, about 500 Japanese yen maybe? And also, you can buy the sword with 10 yen. 
those are more like snacks oh inside they have cheap sweets three for ten <laughs> why not oh my goodness so natsukashi let's get three ten yuan also the souvenirs they have cashier <laughs> nice. Oh, so this is the smallest one? I think 10 yen. Right now, I have 290 yen. This money looks a bit old, but don't worry, it's new. So I just asked what it is, and then now I know. That's one of the right over here, the Zenitendo. It's from anime, Zenitendo. I've never seen this anime. They have a wandering snack. If you buy the ticket, you can get inside and you can experience the attraction. Well, I've never watched the anime, so probably I can't really enjoy it. So why not? Let's enjoy the food because 110 Japanese yen a bit expensive. So let's get the food. <laughs> <laughs> Suddenly, the thief come out. He said he's escaping from the police, and the, oh, the police came. <laughs> Moving to the next place. I'm wondering where we're going to. We came to the end of the arcade. Sweet, good job. Well, suddenly the show was started a uh, surprise, but it's really entertaining. Well, so I guess they are the acrobatic actors. Uh, so let's explore the food place. It's the old firefighter station. That's all the sealed store. And uh, all the fun. You can't buy those, but uh, maybe you can find some old cigarette over here. I don't smoke, so I have no idea though. Also, that's old beauty salon. It's closing though. Well, inside, really detailed. Ah, uh, here, they sell seafood. Many fishes are here, but uh, of course, it's not the real one. And this one, I think you can actually touch the- Oh! <laughs> well, yeah, it's heavy and uh, <laughs> a kind of weird feeling when you touch it, yeah. Well, yeah, pretty similar to the real fish. They sell squid leg. Octopus skewers and also beer too. We still have 290 yen, so why not? Let's get the food over here. So total 147 yen. And uh, I have 150 yen left. Oh wait, seems like something going on over there. Let's go to check. We have to wait five minutes. Oh, that's old style kamishibai. Kamishibai, story girls. Recently, I've never seen this kamishibai yasan, but uh, in the old time, after the story touring, they sell the cheap sweets to the kids. Really classic style. <laughs> Well, this one neither. I've never seen the real one, but uh, for older people, must be super natsukashi. Well, I guess my food is almost ready, so let's go back to the store. 
All right, it's ready. Ah, すみません、ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。いただきます。All right, sweet. We got the food. Let's eat. There is a plenty space of eating. Here we go. Oh, I love this place because let's be poor. Well, I'm not sure. Saturday and Sunday, how crowded it will be. Anyway, so I got the food here. The squid and octopus. It must be perfect with beer. <laughs> There's an airplane. It's super noisy. Hold on one second. All right, so sweet. I got the beer. Octopus. Loving it. Kampai. Mmm. Very delicious. Mmm. Feels like I'm in the Matsuri Festival. Oh my goodness, look at this small cute octopus over here. <laughs> it tastes good and cute too. Ah, in a beautiful sky, really quiet place, <laughs> enjoying this squid and the beer. Psycho. <laughs> Loving it. Oh, speaking of the beer, it was 30 save UM, so. Japanese yen, 360 something. Thinking about the theme park, I think it's pretty good deal. <laughs> By the way, look at this squid. Itadakimasu. Uh, it's grilled with light soy sauce taste. Perfect with beer. Seafood, especially drinking with beer. Well, maybe if you come over here expecting like a theme park like Universal Studios Japan, Disneyland, probably you'll be a little bit disappointed <laughs> because less people and uh, not so much stuff. I will show you guys later. But uh, yeah, if you think about coming to Matsuri Festival, I think it's a good place if there is not that many customers. By the way, those three are the cheap sweets that I got. The first one is a sauce katsu. Well, probably you can expect from the name, it's a sauce katsu. It's like it's like a cutlet with sauce. But this one made by the fish meat. I think when I was a kid, it was like a thirty Japanese yen, maybe. Hmm. Cheap sweets always good with beer. If you wanna find the cheap sweets in Japan right now. Probably you want to go to the Don Quixote because we don't have cheap sweet store anymore. And the next one is Kinakobo. So it's like a mochi, but honey flavor. Yeah, it tastes like a candy with the Kinako flavor with the honey. Kinako is a really popular soybean powder, usually eat with mochi. And this one is based by that mochi. If you love Kinako mochi, probably you will like this too. Oh my goodness, it's super windy and cold. <laughs> Maybe that's the reason why you know so many people today. And this is the last cheap sweet, Cocoa cigarette. As you can expect from the name, it's designed a cigarette with the cocoa taste. Of course, you can eat it. It's like a candy. Oh. Nowadays, Japan gets more strict so that the anime characters don't have much cigarette but before, Cool anime characters always, you know, take a cigarette. Look at that right now. The thief came over here. So basically, the actors are going around and then try to entertain you in many places. So as long as if you are in this arcade, maybe you can have many good surprises. So speaking of the cigarette, when I was a kid, I thought it's cool because many cool anime characters smoking cigarette. But for now. I know that the cigarette is not good for your health, so I think this sweets, yeah, not good for kids' education. I don't recommend it. Unfortunately, mm. this one tastes good though. <laughs> yep, I miss this taste, but I will never give this sweets to my kids. Yeah. All right, now let's go for the next food. Still, we have more. <laughs> the thief were caught again by police. They will fight again and take us to this spacey place. <laughs> Let's 
let's keep exploring. That sushi store, but seems like it's not open. And the 12th place, neither. <laughs> <laughs> really entertaining. Oh, there is Enichi Street, which is the Matsuri Festival. <laughs> Doesn't seem like they have Matsuri, but let's go to check before I spend all my Seibu Yuan. So it's like carnival. This one, throw the ball and beat the Oni. And uh, this one, the crush the can. And this one called Wanage, throw the hoop. If you throw the hoop and uh, the hoop into the items you can get that it's really traditional japanese game and uh, fishing i'm wondering what kind of fish they have if you can fish it you can change it with the price it's merry-go-round eh? <laughs> i think this is one of the old sorry let me rephrase it classic merry-go-round recently i've ever seen why not let's try <laughs> usually it's horse but uh this one the giraffe oh this one doesn't move here on top it will move oh austin let's try this no i changed my mind the lion would be better let's try rider <laughs> <laughs> the Ryan ride. Let's go, Ryan. Go. <laughs> well, when I was a kid, I felt so much fun with riding on the merry-go-round, but maybe now, yeah, I just grew up. Well, probably my niece and nephews, they will love it though. Oh, there's a train ride. Let's ride this train. Maybe we can check the park. Okay, so seems like the seats are pretty much empty. Why not? Let's take a front seat. Here. Well, staff came over to my place and then he told me that we can't sit the first one. I don't know the reason why, but anyone is sitting in the second train. So, yeah, that's why I move. But anyway, let's enjoy. Wow. It's my It's a really popular old anime in Japan, the Lion Tail. Yep, that's the main character of Leo. Oh yeah, over there. Wow. Oh, you know what? I didn't know that today they close at 5. So before closing uh, the let's go try the main rider, the Godzilla. Well, I heard it. I'm not sure how long is the waiting time, so let's go. Yep, that's the ride I really wanted to try, and uh, that's the reason I came over here too, so I don't want to miss that. <laughs> yep, it's over there. Let's keep walking quick. All right, here we go. Seems like waiting time is zero minutes. So. Sweet. Okay, so this is the way. By the way, they have a fast pass, but definitely today we don't need that. In the busy season, must be there'll be a long line here, but now we can just walk. And here we go, this is the entrance. So it's in the second floor. We have to go. Really classic theater. Wow. Uh, I can just say wow. Well, I was expecting a much simple ride. However, so basically the ride 
it's have you guys ride on the soaring in the Disneyland? You sit down in the chair, but that chair will fly, and there is a huge screen. And when the screen moves, the chair will move too. But it's not like a 3D chair because it's literally flying. And the Godzilla came out and the fight with King Ghidorah. You watching the, their fight? It's much much scary than what I told. Uh, there was only three people in the ride. Uh, me and the other dating young couple. But that dating young couple, when she see the ride. I think she realized that uh, it's the scary one, so she quit. So only me was watching that movie. It's amazing and uh, really high quality. Definitely, if you come over here, don't miss that. Uh, well, it kind of going up and it makes me scared too. However, definitely, it was a good ride. <laughs> Still, I'm super excited. So pity that I couldn't film it, but if you visit here, make sure to visit that. Definitely, yeah. Spend time for waiting, that's okay. You know, make sure to try that, that goes here, right? And you know what's sad? I was planning to visit that restaurant over here, but the last call, yep. It's already closed, 4.30. So, let's find the street food. Well, I still have 150 yen, so this one I can use it only today. So let's find some good food. First, uh, let's eat dango. Oh, they have a miso dango. Walnuts inside. Let's try it. Hi, Sweet. All right. This is the miso dango, the miso flavor. Walnuts is inside. My first time. Itadakimasu. It's delicious. The miso is kind of a little bit spicy and salty. Perfectly matches with sweet dango. I really enjoy it. <laughs> <laughs> he said he wanted to try that. <laughs> I wish I can share. Speaking with this dango, you can find it in many places. I remember I found in the Yomi Uri theme park too, and also Meiji Jingu Shrine's festival place, and uh, sometimes, yeah, on the street as well. Well, I'm wondering if they are using the same dango, but uh, price would be different depending on the places. However, the basically taste is similar, so if you find it, maybe you can try it. Mm. It's good. <laughs> this place sells the Japanese sweets. Let's go check inside. Oh, they have whiskey bonbon, which is the chocolate, but the whiskey inside. Usually it tastes good, so let me see what they have. <laughs> I thought it's a chocolate, but actually it's a candy. So maybe a different one. <laughs> and they have also the candies. Here, they have sweets. Daigakuimo, whipped cream sweat. This sweet potato. Let's eat. Hi, it's my Sweet. So it was 50 save yen. All right, I found the perfect way to spend. So 30 yen for the, this menchikatsu. Hi, sasen, And you know another 30 Japanese yen? Yes, we came back here again. Hi, sasen, Sweet. And it's all done. I can't hold it, but uh, my food. I can just place it because no I here. This is the food that I got. Uh, it's a uh, menchi katsu. Itadakimasu. Oh. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Still performing over there. Actually this menchi katsu is pretty good. I'm not sure how long it was there because it was almost time to avoid closing. But uh Still, perfect with beer. And this is the sweet called the Daigakuimo. Usually it's a snack, but this time it's like a parfait. Interesting. 
So basically, it's a sweet potato, but outside, it's candied. いただきます。めっちゃ美味しい。It's my first time to try the daikaku imo with the whipped cream, but actually it tastes pretty good. When you bite it at the first time, you feel like a candy sweetness, but after that, when you bite it, you can feel the flavor of potato, which is not that sweet. So nice match. Well, it's a little bit weird combination, but it's pretty good. <laughs> well, you know what? I think it's time of hot closing, so I gotta eat really quick. When you come over here, make sure check the closing time because sometimes they close really early. Today, 5 p.m. I thought it's 8. Yeah, sometimes it happens. Now it's time for closing. The arcade has become really quiet. Well, it's really nice atmosphere. It's retro town, and I love it. Nice atmosphere. Oh, I didn't realize it when I entered, but those advertisement is super classic as well. And those are the main characters over here. Yes, that one talking about Jungle Tiger Leo, the Lion's Leo, and the Astro Boy Tezuka Adam. They are all from Tezuka Osam. That was really fun. I always wanted to come over here after they made the retro town and the Godzilla ride. Actually, the retro town and the Godzilla ride it was amazing, especially the Godzilla ride. If you love Godzilla, definitely you gotta try it at least one. But、uh, if you wanna bring the kids, you gotta be careful because if you think it's just a theater, it's more like ride. And also, if you don't like the high place, they use the more like a soaring system in the Disneyland. So,、uh, you fly and fight with Godzilla, and then you know, get be attacked by King Ghidorah. So, if you're afraid of the heights, you gotta be careful too. Well, I'm afraid of the heights, but、uh, you know, <laughs> could enjoy it. It was really scary too, though. But、uh, you know, you really, really, really afraid of the heights. You gotta be careful. That's something what I wanna say. Anyway, it's the Seven UNG in Saitama Prefecture, the retro food street, and the Gazelle Ride. Inside, there are more rides, but I guess、uh, you know pretty similar to the merry-go-round and、uh, that train ride. So not that excitement. However, the kids would love it. So if you wanna enjoy the retro Japan town. Maybe you can visit here, and then you can enjoy the same in UN. Hope you enjoy the video. There are more travel ideas video in Japan. If you haven't, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button so that you will not miss my new video and surprise live stream. Big thank you to all of the Patreons. Ayato. If you haven't, please don't forget to check my Patreon account. So hope you enjoy the video. See you in the next video. See you. Go. Have a great day and night. Bye bye. Well, I'm pretty serious. I give you a really important advice when you travel. Ready? Check the closing time before you visit somewhere. <laughs> If you feel like, of course, good job. <laughs>